Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Let's talk about it, Media 21. Listen in in regards to what happened to Marlo. I profile victims, one of them, Marlo Hampton of Real Housewives of Atlanta fame, who told me she watched on her security system as armed, masked men kicked her door down, making a loud boom. When I heard the boom, when I heard my nephew scream, and I knew that scream was a scream of fear, my heart dropped. Real Housewives of Atlanta star Marlo Hampton says she's a real crime victim. After the attempted burglary of her Sandy Springs home July 1st, that police have now told her is tied to other incidents. She said she went to a panic room, called 911. The suspects who kicked her door and fled, possibly because she yelled. Sandy Springs police were there quickly, and she thanks God. Just thank God that we're covered in the blood of Jesus, and I'm here to share this story with you. But my main concern is I want all the ladies... I want everyone to be aware. If you are posting items, if you do have luxury items, be careful. Don't you move! A Sandy Spring investigation and high profile victims. One of them. So everyone's thankful that Marlo's okay. There is a lot going on in Atlanta. So everyone needs to be very careful. Be very safe. Make sure your alarms are set always. Make sure you're alert of your surroundings. A friend of mine was actually at a gas station, got gas, paid gas, paid, paid with like a hundred dollar bill and got like, I don't know, $20, $40 worth of gas. And this was about a year ago. And unfortunately, her car was stolen. Her car was stolen and people used her vehicle to uh, grab an ATM. So you have to be very, very careful of your surroundings. Um, allegedly that one gas station is where a lot of vehicles, if you had some kind of SUV, the SUVs were used, they were follow the person home and then they were still their vehicle. So I'm glad that Marlo's okay. Every city has something that's going on. So I'm glad that Marlo's okay. It's being alleged that a few people in Atlanta have been targeted well off, well established. Everyone has to make sure your alarm is set. If you're, if you're out of town, maybe post when you're coming back or something like that. But well wishes to Marlo. It's very, very scary. A real crime victim. After the attempted burglary of her Sandy Springs home July 1st, that police have now told her is tied to other incidents. She said she went to a panic room, called 911. The suspects who kicked her door and fled, possibly because she yelled. Sandy Springs police were there quickly, and she thanks God. Just thank God that we're covered in the blood of Jesus, and I'm here to share this story with you. But my main concern is I want all the ladies, I want everyone to be aware. If you are posting items, if you do have luxury items, be careful. Don't you move! A Sandy Spring investigation and high profile. One of them. So many things are going on in many cities, but they're basically saying home invasions are really high right now in the Atlanta area. So everyone be safe. Make sure you and your family are protected. Like she mentioned in her um, video, she has a safe spot where her and her nephews went and she screamed. So she definitely let them know she was there. And if she probably wouldn't have screamed, maybe they would have continued to come on in. Maybe they thought she wasn't there. So many blessings to Marlo. Everyone's happy that she's okay. Her and her nephews are safe. So many blessings to her. So there's a lot that's going on in Atlanta. If you've heard the news, there's been a, quite a few arrests in Atlanta too. So uh, well wishes to Marlo. Thanks for tuning in. 